What is going on lads, what's the crack and welcome back to another Hidden Gems video. So today we are taking a look at Lionel Messi, one of the best players in the game, one of the best players in the history of football. Who is going to compare to him? Well not one, but two players are in comparison here today for GP. Both are under 100,000 GP as well, so it should be an interesting video. Now I will say, right, for the purposes of this, we are treating Messi as an AMF, which I think is his strongest position, and we are focusing on his standard card. If you have got his legend card, it is probably one of the best cards in the game full stop, let alone the best version of Messi. Him and that Neymar card, them two legend cards that released way back when with eFootball 2022 are absolutely insane and they will be on every single player's list if they have them, right? You know, they are just unbeatable. They've got so many amazing stats. But for the standard version, if you've missed out on those, we are going to be taking a look at a dribble-centric player who we have here in Vritz who plays for Leverkusen and we're also going to be taking a look at a pass-centric player as well so no one player fits the kind of mold of Messi but these are excellent alternatives under 100,000 GP if you want to stay within that budget and you want to have a player that is extremely similar to Messi and you're a skilled enough player to actually be able to play with these guys these guys, Vritz is an attacking midfielder, he's a whole player, he actually lines up with Messi um, a lot better than the other option, which we'll get to in a second, but uh, as this is a hidden gem series, I want to show you guys different things. So Vritz fits in here as an AMF, he can also play right wing, so he's extremely similar to Messi in height, in player skills, you can see their double touch, you can see long range curler, he's got the finesse shots, one touch pass, pinpoint crossing, you've got true passing, chip shot control, cut behind and turn, chop turn, he's uh, very, very cheap as well but he is not as cheap as Kovacic now you might think I've lost my mind but as I said we are comparing Messi not as a right winger or not as a striker or an SS we are comparing players as an AMF Messi I think is one of the best AMFs in the game if you play him in the hole just being able to pick off passes bring players in touch and go and then if your opponent is backing off you and you have the run of your opponent on defense you can do those finesse shots either low or high driven finesse shots Kovacic lines up with Messi ex excellently, right? He's got unwavering form. Vritz does not have unwavering form. He's got standard form. So with Messi here having unwavering form, You've also got Kovacic with a lot of those, uh, you know, skills as well. Weighted pass, one-touch pass. He's also going to be a bit, a little bit more defensive, obviously. But we're going to be playing Kovacic as an AMF, like an outright whole player, not really worrying too much about defense, not really worrying about tracking back or getting back or intercepting anything. Now, when we take a look at Messi's stats, and we're going to get a clearer screen in a second here, we will look at Messi's stats here. And the thing that sticks out, obviously, with Messi as in real life is his dribbling, his passing, and his shooting. For the purposes of this, as an AMF, we are not really going to be focusing on Messi as a finishing uh, player. You know, he's not going to be a center forward for us with this video. A uh, offensive awareness is only important if you are making runs in against the line. So we're not really going to focus on that. What we are focusing on is speed, acceleration, the dribbling stats that you see here, and then the passing stats and balance. That's kind of what we're going to be going for here. And I think that these two players really align up with Messi, like as I said, exceptionally well. Like if you are a pass first type of player, if you're a triangle player, if you play a lot of triangle, if you play a lot of tiki taka, you'll be able to get Kovacic for 82,000 GP. If you want somebody that's even more like Messi, you've got the finesse shooting for the player skills, you've got speed, acceleration, ball control, and low pass, all either identical or slightly better than Messi's card, both standard versions, obviously. As I said, if the legend card, if you have that in your possession, that is an unbelievable card to have in eFootball 2023. There is no real comparison between Messi's legend card or Neymar's legend card with their standard version because they have got some very unique skill sets and player skills and stuff like that that can go really high levels. But when you break it down here on eFootballDB.com and you look at the compare, the compare, the compare, uh, comparison between these guys, the compare feature, you will see here just how alike these players are. So as I said before, you've got speed, you've got Ritz at 79, Messi 78, and then Kovacic at 80. Acceleration, 85, 80, 83. You've got ball control, 88, 88, 91 dribbling 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 is all pretty much the same obviously Messi has got better passing for the lofted pass he's got better balance but he doesn't have better balance or, or dribbling type possession or low passing than Kovacic 
but he doesn't have as good tight possession or dribbling as Vritz. So obviously the big thing here is the standard form versus the unwavering form. Messi is always usually up. So as I said, right, depending on the type of player that you are, a lot of people have been asking me for this where I do a hidden gem and, you know, I have kind of uh, players that I really like enjoy to play with and hidden gems that can actually make a huge difference in your squad for a very little GP that you can get in a single session that you sit down and do all the events, right? So for if you want a dribble-centric approach, if you want a dribble-centric alternative to Messi, Vritz is the way to go, right? He's 91 overall, he's got 39 levels to go, similar height, similar weight, similar movement, similar player skills, aligns extremely well with Messi, if you are going to play him the way that you want to play, dribbling, you know, if you're dribble centric, if you want to play a lot of dribbles, like, you know, acceleration, closing the ball out, um, like tiki taka, not as much passing as Kovacic. Kovacic is all going to be about if you are going to get in Kovacic, if you are going to miss out on Messi, because remember, Messi is 740,000 GP. It's a lot of money, three quarters of a mil. Uh, GP for Messi so if you are looking at one of these guys and you're thinking okay well I don't want Kovacic because his dribbling isn't uh, you know he's not a small enough frame he doesn't handle like Messi he doesn't control like Messi even though he's got better stats I want Fritz then that is the way to go if you want dribbling if you want passing and you want him to be the pass master in the hole you've got Kovacic who plays like Pedri that is kind of how he plays and Messi and then you also have the shooting that you're able to do with Fritz so let me know what you guys think of this do you prefer the two man approach or would you like me to just have one hidden gem but that is it for another video that is messy you've got a lot of brilliant alternatives here for the star players such as Mbappe check that out if you haven't we've got one for Neymar if you haven't checked that out check it out and as I said these two guys there's two options for you you've got a dribble guy you've got a passing guy you can play him in multiple dis different positions you can play multiple different play styles they line up with Messi Messi is still going to be Messi but if you do not have 750,000 GP to spend on Messi Personally, I don't think his standard card is worth that. I would nearly buy the two of these boys and interlink them compared to buying Messi because you've got Kovacic with the unwavering and you've got Vritz with the dribbling and plays extremely like Messi. There are other players out there, but these are two of my highlights and two of my recommendations. So that is it for me, lads, with another Hidden Gem video. Let me know if you enjoy these. Let me know if you enjoy this style more than the you know 1v1 comparison. I will talk to you later. Peace.